soap, deodorant, toothbrushes, face wash. These are just a few of the things that can be found at Oxford Intermediate School's clothing closet. Volunteers like Tatum Freeman are responsible for stocking the various items. They can look by size, they can grab their items. We even have a mirror back here where they can, it feels like a store. It should feel like a store to the child where they walk in and they get to try it on and walk out with a new outfit with new toiletries for the month. Community members make sure that Oxford Intermediate School is full of new and donated items from blue jean jackets to sweatpants and even things like tennis shoes and toiletries. And Freeman says she hopes that every school in the LLU community it has a full functioning clothes closet. We just have amazing people in this community and there's no reason why they shouldn't be at every school. I just think people don't know that it's this big need. Oxford Elementary School's counselor, Amy King, sees the need daily. And we noticed that this young man was wearing shorts and, you know, he did not have a pair of, of pants that fit. And so he's just been rocking shorts. And he has the, the best attitude about his shorts. Yeah, but he wouldn't even know that he was in need. Yeah. He's just having a good time. Yeah. Heather White plays a huge role in the clothing closets and says the hope is that all students have the necessities this Christmas. Now a lot of gloves and hats um, for the winter. We have um, some needs over with the upper schools for heavier coats. If you want to get involved, you can contact your local school's guidance counselor. It's not rocket science. It's not the hardest thing, but it could be life-changing to a kid. DeAndrea Turner, Newswatch, Ole Miss.